So hello guys, this is Adrian. Welcome back to my channel. So I have another travel vlog for you guys and this time I am going to Bohol. I've been planning to go to Bohol since the year 2020. However, pandemic happened so travel and plans changed. However, with the restrictions getting a bit easier right now, um, I think it's okay to travel but we still have to make sure that we follow safety protocols as, such as wearing a face masks and we still need to be cautious and be aware of our surroundings as well so this would be another solo travel for me it's gonna be the second time i am going to have a solo travel um, i had it when i traveled to iloilo for my birthday and this time to boho i really can't wait you know it's i'm really excited how my excitement shows or feels during my one vlog when I saw Mount Mayon it feels the same excitement that I'll be able to see the chocolate hills, the Tarshir in Bohol and all of those you know <clears throat> tourist attractions that we normally see on graphic cards or even the notebooks on Universal Elementary pero hindi ko talaga alam bata ako nagi English <laughs> But um, I think it's 7.25, my flight leaves at 2.20pm, th uh, so I'm gonna start preparing, although I started to pack my medicine kit and all kahapon. Ngayon ako I'm going to pack my clothes ko for this trip, and wala, sobra excited ko lang talaga. so I'm gonna show you guys what Bohol can bring, or my Bohol can show us and I'm pretty much sure I'm just gonna enjoy this trip and you know time for a me time sabi nga nila and I deserve that me time and ayun enjoy lang so now I'm gonna pack my things um ayan magulo na yung kama ko kasi I did not fix my bed anymore um so anyway I'm gonna see you guys later so ayusin muna ka ng gamit Bye! So I'm currently here. I'm currently here waiting for my flight. So I don't have any plans on this new date. So I'm going to go. Um, one of the boarding but just waiting here. For those who are here, I suggest you go early because medyo mahaba yung pila sa labas as what you have uh, seen on the clip earlier. So, ayun. I can't wait to go to Bohol and it feels different now traveling alone again. But I know it's gonna be fun and I'm going to enjoy my trip and maybe we can get away so there's a slight change in our flight so originally boarding now minus 115 but changed to 135 so waiting game again <laughs> So I'm 
currently here in Bohol, Pangalawa International Airport, safely landed. I guess I'm so happy with the captain or the pilot, one of the um, sleekest landing ever. So let's go and look for the van of Henan because I bought an airport transfer going to Henan Alona. So I'm gonna see you guys later. Bye! pwedeng hindi. So, ayan. First, the, my stuff. Hindi pa ako nagsasettle. So, ayun. And then, pagpasok nyo, here's the CR. So, this is a deluxe room lang naman. So, good thing may bidet. And then, the shower. Hindi siya yung tulad ng iba na may see-through frosted. Pero, okay na rin naman. I mean, yeah. And then, next one is Ayan, laki ng room, no? The last room lang. But, henan yun eh. So, that's a bed. I'm not sure if that's a queen or king. Laki eh. Parang hindi siya pang double. So, and then, meron tayo itong chairs and table. And then, a vanity. The TV. And then, meron ng mini terrace. Kaso yung terrace kasi facing the convention center of henan. There. You know? Ayan, so that's a convention center. Anyway, so I'm here alone. <laughs> alone tayo dito in this huge bed. But, syempre enjoy natin to because we deserve this. Pero medyo masakit na yung ulo ko. Feeling ko sa gutom na rin. But, wala, nakakatawa. Anyway, I'll go out in a bit. I'll just set all my stuff and then I'll roam around Tonglao. So, let's go. Anyway, so before I go out, just a quick mm, feedback or review maybe. Uh, medyo matagal lang yung check encounters tala. Uh, medyo nagpile up yung pila kanina. Um, although, siguro because of the mga requests ng guests during check-in. Kasi nung ako naman, mabilis naman. I mean, smooth naman yung naging transaction namin. But overall, kumbaga, medyo since nag-pile up yung pila kanina, tumagal lang. But again, baka nga because of the requests of the guest, yung maraming gusto ng ganito, gusto ng ganyan. So, ayun. Um, Room-wise, kita nyo naman sa room tour. Maayos, madinis, maganda, malaki. The bed is big. <laughs> Mag-isa lang ako. 
Tapos, um, ano pa ba? Hindi pa ako nakakaikot eh, technically. So, siguro the next feedback or review would be after na, pag nakaikot na ako. Or before I end this vlog. So, let's see. For now, siguro I'll rest for a bit before going out and then hanap na ako ng food for dinner later. Or pag sinipag, mag-ikot na ako. But for now, hi! <laughs> Enjoy! And I'm heading outside. It's currently... 6.53. So I'll be having my dinner somewhere, kung saan man. Bahala na. And malalakad na rin siguro sa beach. But anyway, so let's go! Hello guys, good morning. <clears throat> so I just had my breakfast. Uh, yung break but break uh, breakfast buffet ni Hanan and kita niyo naman dun sa clips maayos naman yung kanilang breakfast buffet. I just had bread and eggs and all. Um, although dapat talaga um, heavy kasi medyo whole day yung activity today which is yung countryside tour, but Ayun, gusto ko lang talaga ng bread. Pero, anyway, hindi na ako masyado nakapag-vlog kagabi. Um, Nag-ikot-ikot lang kasi talaga ako. Then, had my dinner sa Jollibee. So, para kung ano, nagpunta lang ako ng bowl para mag-Jollibee. Pero, siguro makapag-ikot ako, makapag-try ako ng food talaga. Baka later or sa mga succeeding days. Kasi hanggang Monday ako dito. Um, ayun, so right now I'm preparing. It's past 7.30. Andito na yung driver ng 8 o'clock. So, ano kasi yun? Um, exclusive tour. Bali, ako lang mag-isa dun sa tour. Countryside tour. So, yun yung um, tawag dito. Chocolate Hills, yung Tarshire, ganyan. Sa yung mga yun, yung mga Lubok River, the, the known famous, known na famous pa, yung mga famous places to visit here in Bohol. So, syempre, dahil lalabas tayo, ngayon natin alam kung maaraw, sunblock. So, ayun. Anyway, nakatas ko lang din maligo. <clears throat> Tapos, meron pa rin ako nito, nag nabili ko to dun sa Watsons, if you've watched my ang um, Kalagwas vlog, doon ko siya unang tinray. So, so far, okay naman siya. Um, nakakadagdag freshness. Wow! Freshness. So, anyway, um, ang ganda ng lighting dito. Parang feeling ko ang kinis-kinis ko kahit hindi naman talaga. Pero, let's go kasi magbibihis na ako. Um, Ayun. Anyway, um, it was a good night, actually, last night. Um, Na-enjoy ko naman siya. Naglakad-lakad ako sa beach kagabi. Naglakad ako sa my uh, main road. Uh, looking for food, ganyan. Para at least medyo may idea na ako kung sana ako pwedeng kumain or well, places or restaurants to visit, ganyan. And I met a local then yesterday. Um, well, last night. So, chika-chikahan lang kami. Nagtanong-tanong ako ng mga masasarap kainan, ganyan. And then, I had two bottles of San Miguel Light lang kagabi. Just chill. Tsaka pang pa. Um, tulog, in a way na rin. Pero, <clears throat> late na rin ako nakatulog. Siguro mga 12 na rin. Or, 1 na nga ata. So, let me just put down these plants para maliwanag. Anyway, so... Ayun, I'm gonna see you guys later for the tour and really hoping for a great experience today. So, I'm gonna see you guys later. Bye! So, ito muna natin pupuntaan ko yan. So, wait here si TV is off of the hills. It's Kuya Manuel. Aking driver today. Kasi mag-isa nga lang ako. So, chocolate hills yung muna namin pupuntaan. Magkano yung ating ito? Depende sa, ano, may isang oras at may kalating oras. Pero 
Carmen So nanitin siya ko na So ito yung una namin stopover for today So kasama ko pa rin si Kaya Manuel Siya yung magpipicture sa akin sa taas Hindi na ako nag-ATV um, Pero post ko dito yung presyo ng ATV na nakita natin Ito, meron parking dito. Tapos, may service nila papuntang sa Palit Hills. Doon sa mga. Let's go! back inside the car it's really satisfying and it feels so real to actually see top of the hills just like nga nung mention ko before when I saw Mount Mayaman grab yung experience when you see this known tourist attractions in the Philippines na you would normally see in postcards or even notebooks and now I'm seeing them in person currently here <coughs> sa Bohol Enchanted sa may Bilar Ayan. so dito daw yung Tarshir na medyo mas malapit mo siyang mapipicturean compared dun sa isa na malayo na so and sabi ni kuya ito din daw yung may iba't ibang hayop din hindi lang Tarshir yung makikita so let us see let's go pero bibili muna ng ticket pero dahil nakatura ko paid na yung ticket. Kukunin na lang niya. Ayan. Dyan. So we're getting inside the tariff here. So just like everybody else's vlog, you have to remain quiet and not disturb them. Ayun. So, pag gusto niyo mag-avail ng tunnel tour, additional 10 pesos lang naman. So, why not? So, ayan. This is it. Ayan. Ito yung tunnel. Marami pa daw animals na nandito. So, might as well go. Toto, nandito naman na. Tapos 10 pesos lang naman yung dadagdag mo. So, ayun.
and now we're heading to the man-made forest one of the most sort of place here in Bohol so nagdadating yan pa lang yung mga tours dito unahan na namin dito na lang mabilis lang kami ni Kuya mauna na kami doon kasi pang matagalan malamang yung mga picture doon sa man-made forest pero ayun it's good and maganda sa loob kasi they get to educate you with the lifespan of the butterflies yung life development nila then meron ding mga additional knowledge sa ibang mga animals there so kumbaga very ano informative yung pagpasok mo doon so very worth it and for sure kung may bata kayong kasama may enjoy ng bata yan kasi matutuwa talaga sila seeing those animals there The struggle is real, magpicture. Sunod-sunod yung mga dating ng sasakyan. Tapos, pumupwesto na ako. Lapag ko na yung tripod. May mga umeksena. Doon talaga sila pumwesto. Eh, hindi na ako nakapicture. Tsaka video. Para sila. Sila na lang mo. So sa wakas, natapos na ako magpicture. Nauna muna silang lahat, pinauna ko na silang lahat kasi nakakaya sa <laughs> Pero ayun, natis na kapag picture na ulit. Now we're on our way to Lubok River for lunch. So, buto na rin ako kapag yung pinagagagawa ko para lang magpicture. Let's go! So we skip Lubok River. Sabi ko kay Kuya, dali nyo na lang ako sa mga karinderiya. But for now, nandito kami sa Baklayon Church. Ito yung nasira nung may bagyo or earthquake pa. Yan na. Ito nyo. Tapos ito yung bell tower. Yan. So hanggang ngayon, under renovation pa rin siya or under construction. So... Dito na muna kami. Sabi ko kay Kuya, eh, magdadasal mo na ako for Thanksgiving and everything. So, let's go. decided to eat lunch here a bit late lunch but I decided na late na lang kumain so inunan namin yung mga dapat yung ha so we're at Lantau Buho native restaurant so anyway ayun I'm back here sa hotel room Um, kakatapos na ng countryside tour and it's really fun and nakakatuwa kasi kahit um, solo lang talaga ako kasi nga exclusive yung tour I mean yun yung binok um, nakakatuwa yung driver si Kuya Manuel sobrang masiyahin jolly, makwento hindi ka talaga mabubor kumbaga buti pa siya maraming ambag na kwento ganon As in, sobrang dami niyang kwento, ang dami niyang um, sinasabing mga, kumbaga, informative things. Tapos, pag tinanong ko siya, Kuya, saan ba may ganito? Saan ba may ganyan? Dadali niya ako, ganyan. So, napaka-bait, napaka-galang, and alam mo yun, parang game na game din si Kuya sa mga, ano, 
yung mga tanong mo na alam niya kung saan dapat pumunta, kung saan dapat yung mas okay, ganyan. Although, ayun nga, we skipped the Lubok River, although it was my decision. Um, pero yung price kasi nun parang $8.50 daw. And I think, um, kailangan talaga punuin yung boat bago umali. So sabi ko, baka hindi natin mapuno agad. E gutom na rin ako. So sabi ko, hanap na lang kami ng makakainan. Kaya doon kami kumain sa ano. Um, pangalan nun? <laughs> Ayun. So, and then after that, um, yun na. Dumiretso na kami dito. Hinatid na ako ulit. Tapos, ayan, pahinga. Nag-quick, ano lang ako, shower, quick, wash up. And, ayun, nakakapagod pero sobrang fun. I mean, I get to see Chocolate Hills, I get to see the Tarshir up close. And, yun yung maganda kasi na, although mag-isa lang ako, hindi ko na-feel talaga kasi nga, as in the whole time, nagsitsikahan lang kami ni Kuya Driver. As in, kung ano nung mga bagay na yung pinagsitsikahan namin dalawa. Kung gusto nyo, um... I'll put down uh, the link on the description box below and lagay ko din dito yung pangalan ng um, Facebook page na pinagkuhaan ko ng exclusive tours. So the exclusive tour that I got is 5,900 or 5,950 around that um, range. Um, for one pack yun, exclusive yun, again, kayo lang ng driver talaga. Pero syempre it gets to differ naman kapag may kasama ka. Pero pwede naman. Um, hindi sila nag-joiner. They're more on the exclusive tours talaga. So, okay na din yun for me. Kesa mag-joiner na ang dami mong ihisipi, intindihin mo yung decision ng iba, ganyan. At least yun. Although pricey talaga. But, at least hawak may oras mo. Kung baga, pag gusto mo magstay sa isang lugar, then you can stay. Tulad nung sa man-made forest, since ang dami ng tao kanina, um, nakapag-stay kami, nakapag-shoot ako na halos wala na rin tao, ganyan. So, yun. Yun yung advantage talaga nun. Siyempre, yung, yung disadvantage nun, yun nga, pricey kasi siya. But, again, if gusto mo naman ng something private talaga, and hawak mo yung oras mo, then I suggest go for an exclusive tour. So, yung um, countryside tour kasi kanina is around 8am. So, yung island hopping would be 6am tomorrow. So, hindi ako pwedeng magpuyat because maaga yung gising. Although, as a morning person, wala naman problema sa akin gumising na maaga. So, ayun. So, this is it. Kasi, as a hubadero myself, ito na naman po tayo sa mga pahubad. So, I'm gonna somehow expect na maninegro na naman po tayo for today's video. But, anyway, tonight, I'm not sure. Sorry, hindi ko na kayo na tour sa Henan, but I'll try to um shoot some clips sa loob ng Henan para makita niyo yung itsura talaga ng Henan but yun 